This is Gene Key, KDD News. For Dumas and Moore County, it's snowfall number two for the fall winter season of 2011-2012. Police were out in full force across the Panhandle as dozens of wrecks were reported starting yesterday morning. Roads across the Panhandle continue to be slick as temperatures are staying below freezing. According to Greg Wright, KDD's weather guy, Texas Department of Public Safety continues discouraging travel in the Texas Panhandle through tonight. Troopers responding to vehicle crashes and stranded motorists have been kept busy. DPS also said that response time may be delayed due to weather conditions. The Texas Department of Transportation reports roads continue to be very slick. ConnectAmarillo.com reports from Fritch. Preliminary autopsy results are in on the man found dead in a Fritch residence Friday afternoon. The Carson County Sheriff's Department said the results indicated Larry Ewing King, 57, suffered from cardiovascular disease and there were indications of puncture marks on his arm. No trauma or obvious signs of foul play were found on his body. Fritch Police and EMS were first called to the 400 block of Boyd in Fritch on Friday, just after 4 p.m. Officers found King deceased in a bedroom. His death was classified as suspicious. According to officials, King was on parole for various offenses, including an original charge of aggravated robbery in Randall County. Dumas Junior High School and Dumas High School students competed in the Dumas Dual University Interscholastic League competition last Saturday. It took place in the Dumas High School, according to UIL sponsor Pam Wood. Approximately 80 Dumas students competed in the event against Paladuro, Clarendon, and Borger. Clarendon took the small school sweepstakes trophy. Dumas won the big school sweepstakes trophy. If you would like the latest Dumas Panhandle and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD News.